I discovered astrology by accident. I had a, a good foundation, a spiritual foundation, and from within that context, I realized I had these spiritual gifts. And one day, I randomly stumbled upon an astrology book, and I read it cover to cover, constructed my chart, and it made sense to me. I could combine both my spiritual gifts and my spiritual awareness with this tool, this tangible tool that helped me to understand my life and helped me to understand the way the world works a little bit better. And I realized if I could do that for myself, then I could do that for others. And so I made it my mission to help others by using my gifts. A lot of clients come to me because they are wanting to leave a relationship or wanting to fall in love or they're making career changes. They come during transitions but they also come during times that are really exciting. First I check in to see what you're hoping to get out of the session. I ask a couple of introductory questions and then you sit back and relax. What I look at is the path that you're on and the path that you want to be on and I give real tangible tools to overcome some of the hurdles and limitations and fears and beliefs. By the end of the session, my goal is that you leave feeling empowered, feeling like you have some direction about choices that you need to make in your life, and that you have a little bit of hope too for the future, and hope that you can make your future exactly what you want it to be. I never want to tell someone what to do. I never want to tell someone in absolute terms, this is what's going to happen to you. This is your future. Because our future is always changing. Every decision you make, every choice you make, every person you meet affects and influences the trajectory of your life. We can change. We are growing, evolving people that, that have the ability to participate with the universe. Each person has the inner resources to make the changes that they want to make to make their lives more abundant, successful, happy, and love-filled.